Wrong button. <laughs> Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to Soling Atlas. I'm Flinger Fu, and today, well today, I would been taking a look at the map and how little we have actually gotten everything solved, uh, how at little we've actually gotten everything discovered. Because here, let me show you, and I know, bam, right at the very beginning. Hey, let's take a look at maps and charts. Yay! That's exciting, right? <laughs> Alright, so we've been hanging out. Uh, wrong button! That turned off my recording. Alright, so um, we've been... Stop. 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 All right. So we've been hanging out in, um, uh, down here in M7, N7, N6, O6, and O5. So, um, I think what I want to do, I mean, we've been hanging out right in between like the temperate and the, uh, tropical area, and that's kind of good, but I want to see what else there is out there because it's a big map. I mean, big map. And so now I want to, uh, Wow, let's see how far, how big we can actually get our save file to be. <laughs> so yeah, I think what I want to do is, um, because I know if you head east, we'll be able to go, you know, all the way down the alphabet. But if we head, I know if we head west, we can go all the way down the alphabet. I, but I know that if you head east from where we're at, we can actually sail off the edge of the map and then come out onto A6. I think that's what I want to do because eventually... I want to work my way over towards the center, kind of. Uh, not too far, because I, I realize the dead center um, is the Kraken, and I don't want to deal with the Kraken. Um, there's nothing to build there. There's no islands, no nothing like that. The entire zone is taken up by the Kraken. So we don't want to deal with that. Um, but I think... I think that because if we go east, we'll end up in A5, and then if we go south, we'll go to A6, and then B6, and then B7, and then back to A6, and then over to A3, and then we do the trick shot, and then we end up in G5, and then from there, you know, we uh, do the, uh, you know, cover the cross guard, and then we come down and slip around, and then we'll end up down in E12. You know, that's exactly how it works, right? All right, no, um, actually, I think today uh, what we're just going to do is we're going to go see what's to our right because we've been seeing what's to our left. Now we're going to see what's to our right. And um, as you've noticed, I mean, I haven't been shy about making um, oh, little bases all throughout. That way there we can kind of mark our territories. Like this island right here, it's gem territory. I love this island. This island is so good for harvesting up materials, stuff like that. I mean, where I was uh, back on the waterfall island, where I was uh, struggling for... Uh, Oh, fiber at certain times? This one right here, it, fiber's just everywhere. I mean, everywhere. It's amazing. Um, yeah, so, and then the trees, and then the thatch, and then the metal. Oh, matter of fact, that's right. I needed to gather more metal. That's right. Um, we're out of, uh, sorry, 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 sorry. I just had to ju um, juke along the edge of the cannon. Um, yeah, we're out of metal for repairing our boat. Um, so let me grab some of that. I, I was totally, uh, right, right as I was getting everything totally sit. No, 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 no. Thank you. Gosh, coming out of the woodwork and stuff. Give me your bits. All right, uh, let's see. We don't need all the raw animal meat. We've got plenty of cooked meat. All right, let's see. Um, We don't need the stone. You can always use flint, and that doesn't weigh a whole ton. And then the scale's carotenoid, so we're going to need that. Uh, right now, we just need metal. Now, there was a couple uh, um, rocks here on this island that are uh, silver nodes. I mean, just the entire thing. It's silver nodes, and they look kind of like this. Is this one of them? This would be very wicked cool if it was. Yes! Ha ha ha! We've got metal. All right, I think that's all the metal we need because we don't want to overload our ship. But yeah, so today what we're going to do is we're going to head, we're going to go off the edge of the um, the map. We're going to go to World's End, and then we're going to uh, sail across it and see what we uh, get to. Uh, granted, we're probably just going to end up over there. It's going to be great, and it's going to be amazing. But yeah. All right, so now we should be able to... Yes! Oh, wrong button! Okay. All right, all right. Yeah, see? Woohoo! Yay! All right, and we'll just let uh, uh, pretty Charlotte um, fix up the boat for us as we stop. All right, so hey, let's get headed out. All right. 
I see that shark over there. Dude, I'm so sick. Every single time I log in to the game and I get going, sharks just swarm underneath the boat. Yeah, it's insane. I don't understand it. All right, let's see. Um... All right, let's lower the sails. Make sure we don't have any harvestable rocks underneath us because they will put us in a whirlpool that we'll end up dying because that's a bug. Let's see if we can actually head west or head east. Okay, we can actually head east. All right, all right. So, hey, take it easy, Gem Island. You were great while you lasted, buddy. And then also, I mean, this place right here, its it's been really good for taming stuff. This uh, um, this Zone 05, I believe it is. Yeah, that's a good one. Let's see. Okay, that way's east. All right, yeah, we can totally do that. We can totally do that. The wind is with us. Yeah, all right. Don't oversteer. Don't oversteer. Don't over Thank you. Oh, no, I hate the fu- And of co- Oh, hey! All right, yay! Oh, they blew up when they- when, 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 when they saw us coming. Oh, that was so nice of them. All right. And of course, the ship is a little bit heavy. But that's okay. All right, all right, so hey, let's get out there and let's go see what's over in the vast wild yonder and parts unknown. All right, see you guys in a bit. All right, so apparently the fog got so thick that I decided that it was not worth it to uh, go sailing forward any faster or any further. So, yeah. That's a thing. So I guess now I should spend some of this time to uh, check some of the weight here. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So, uh, if anything bad comes and attacks us, just let me know, okay, guys? Alright? Alright, don't you hate it when you're out here, there's nothing to see, and you see those, and everything like that, and you're like, okay, something bad has got to happen soon. And then the longer it goes on that nothing bad happens, the more you start going, okay, something bad. <laughs> Oh my gosh, but yeah, I can't even stop. I can't really even stop and get uh, the loot crates or the uh, um, oh, the flotsam that's in the water because the gold coins they weigh, and I'm already uh, chock full of gold coins. So I think we actually need to see on our travels if we can stop by Freeport, spend some gold coins, and just kind of free up some space on that because I've got just hundreds of uh, pounds of uh, gold coins <laughs> that's taken up weight on the ship. Huh, and there's nothing around here. How close are we to the border? Ooh, we're wicked close. All right. Oh, there's the blue border. I see it. I see it. All right. Let's see. Can we go off of the world's edge? I don't know. All right. Is there going to be a Kraken on the other side? Is it going to come up and grab the ship and its big beak is going to come up? We're going to have to charge at it with our sword. I don't know. I don't have a sword, so maybe I'm ill-equipped for this. I don't know. But it's blue, so that's a good sign. So, yeah. All right. Hold on to your butts, everybody. We're going over the world's edge. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Let's do this. Yeah, traveling to A5. What? Why is it dark here? It was just light on the other side. That's so weird. Oh, and there's... Okay, Ships of the Damned over there. Alright, there's an island over there. How, are, how far down are we? Okay, so to the right, towards the zone border, the Ships of the Damned. Huh. Alright, let's see what we can find here. Alright, so I ended up... There was a whole bunch of... Uh, um. Oh, Ships of the Damned over there. So I ended up coming down to, uh, what, what was this one? Uh, wait, 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 wait. wait. Hmm. Wrong button. Down into A6. And apparently this is a free port. 
And there's ships of the dam down here as well. What? All right, all right, all right. Let's see if we can get over to that island over there. Because, I mean, we need a free port anyway. So, yeah. All right. All right, and then we just have to get past those guys. No, 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 no. You guys stay over there, all right? All right, coming up on this island. Report here somewhere, I just can't see it. I think that might be a skull over there. I don't know, it's like super quiet. It's dead at night. Oh, and there's some rocks right there. Yay! Not hit those. You know what? Maybe I should just wait here until morning time. I think that'd probably be best. <laughs> yep, uh, there's a bunch of rocks there. All right, so let's get uh, let's get moving in a little bit. Go see what we can see. All right, so thankfully, as soon as I parked the boat, that. Uh, it started raining. So, yeah, if there was ever a good time to start raining, now would be it. All right, let's see. Um, let's grab some uh, gold. Yeah, let's grab that much. Uh, that leaves us with 852. All right, and we're, I'm still... I mean, I already went through, and I started... Uh, oh, trying to figure out how to uh, get rid of... Can I get off here? Right, you're in the way. Trouble. You're in the way. Trouble. Trouble. Hold on. Oh, okay. Hold on. All right. Meow, you need to move. All right. Thank you, meow. Oh, no, 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 no. <clears throat> Seriously? All right. That happened. All right. I'm trying to get Smeghead out of here. All right. Come on. Thank you. All right. So let's get our butts inside here and let's go see what we can buy. <laughs> this is really the first time I've uh, come to a free port with just the intention of blowing some excess gold, right? Now, let's see. Hey, Ebony Key! All right, and this free port actually looks pretty dang familiar, so let's see. Oh, we can get all of our... I don't know if I want this stuff. The Hydrofur? I mean, it looks kind of cool. I mean, we could go with Army of the Dam stuff. I mean, that would be kind of cool as well. And then, of course, there's Officer. I don't know if I want that either. Huh. I mean, that does look kind of cool. Yeah, I think I like the Hydra Fur. Oh, that looks cool. How much is that? Yeah? Let's buy that one. All right. All right. What else do you have, dude? A magical. What is this? Put this magical artifact in your item slot and use it when the appropriate creature is near death to instantly bend that creature to your will. It costs 40000 That one costs 20000 that one's 30,000. That one's 30,000 as well. Oh, there's Rock Elemental. Okay, now I'm seeing. All right, Fire Elemental. Ooh, Drake. And a Cyclops? Holy crap, we can tame a Cyclops? We have to first science that. Let's see, Ship Figurehead. Ooh, what is this one? An Axe Figurehead. Okay. A Dragon Figurehead. Lion. Octopus? Ooh. Pegasus, traditional, and Poseidon. Ooh, hey! So it's it's rainy and foggy now. Well, it's a good thing I landed. All right. Uh, let's see. I think I might want the dragon. Yeah. All right. Do we have it? Yes. All right. Let's go see what we can do. Hey, Smeghead. Come on. Oh, well, hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's see. Um. And it's cold here. That's odd. I'm used. I'm so used to being overheating all the time. Oh, hey, look at us. We can make our, our awful armor look great. Yeah, hey, look.
Look at us, Ma! Oh, that's awesome. Hey, that's actually kind of cool. I'm digging that. Now we just need to get some fur armor or some hide armor so we can actually look even better. Maybe even dye it up and all that cool stuff. Okay, but yeah, this island totally does look familiar. It totally does. Um, this is looks like the exact same island that we've always used for our beginning ones on the Patreon servers. Okay, all right. Not this time, but yeah, this is great. I like this island. And of course, there's elephants. You know how much I've wanted an elephant, but I don't know if I could fit it onto uh, Foo's Vengeance. All right, you know what, Spankhead? Just wait right there, okay, buddy? If a shark comes and attacks you, just attack it back, okay? All right, let's see. Let's Can we put the figurehead on here? Or do we have to have it, like, in the dock or something? I don't know. Yeah, you keep that to yourself, Mia. All right? All right, so that happened. Yeah, look at us! We've got Dragon Head! Oh, that is so cool! Oh, yeah! Hold on, I need a screenshot of this. Yeah! And, of course, the giraffe's head is uh, yeah, hanging over the edge. Still! All right, that's that's pretty cool! All right, if only it was sunny. It would have been even better. All right, let's go see what kind of resources we have here. I'm not sure if there will be any since it's a free port, but yeah. And then the Ebony Key. And also, I want to... Uh, uh, probably, I'm thinking... Let's see. Let's take a look at the map. I don't know. Maybe head down to uh, B6? I'm not sure. What's C6? There's something down there on the map that it says there's something. So maybe we should go check that out. I don't know, but I know I want to uh, find a nice island over here that, so we can set up a, uh, um, oh, an outpost over here. And then, I don't know, it depends on if we like the area, we might turn the outpost into our main base and then have the other bases be our outpost. I don't know. Okay, you gotta hand it to these guys. The, this is beautiful. I mean, look at this little bay. Oh my gosh. But, um, there's really not much here. Um, the fiber and stuff that we've, uh, been gathering, it's just regular fibers. Which is not really good for any of the enhanced materials or enhanced recipes that we're trying to create. So we need to move on to a bigger, better bun. But it's nice knowing that we actually have a free port this close to the base. I was not aware of that. Or this close to our la latest outpost. Also, there's a ton of cows here. So when I want to finally tame a cow, when I actually have room on, uh... Oh, Foo's Vengeance to uh, come and tame a cow, then we know where to find one. And that one's only level 4. Alright, you keep being level 4, and then I will move on. Plus, also, there's a ton of elephants, which is really, really good, because I want an elephant. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but if there's an option to have an elephant, I want an elephant. So, yeah. Unless it's Ark, and then a beaver is smaller. So, yeah. Alright, so let's get you up here. Come on. Actually, can we just put you up there? Thank you. Oh, wrong button. All right, and let's get our butt up here, and then let's head out. Because now it's actually daytime. Again. Oh, whoa, I just barely missed that rock. Oh, <laughs> okay. All right, so that happened. All right, let's get our butt out of here. And see where our dragon uh, figurehead takes us. Which is awesome, by the way. How much gold do I have left, anyway? Ah, 377. That's not too bad. Oh, hold on. Alright, but yeah, I think what I want to do... Let's head over to B6. Let's go see what's over in B6. Hopefully it doesn't sink our battleship. But yeah, you know what? We never know what we'll find. And yeah. Okay, now this is kind of cool. There's a Freeport Island right there, and the zone border is right here. Which means that this is actually a really easy uh, Freeport to be next to. So you can just cross the border, go to the Freeport whenever you need to go shopping. Once you have your groceries, you come back over here, and then you go to your base, and you can level up normally. I kind of like that idea. Huh. Okay, and as soon as we cross the border, there's an island right here. Wow, that is wicked cool. Let's take a look at this. That's actually kind of fortuitous for us. That is really cool. 
which means less... Oh, there's even shipwrecks over there. We're going to have to... You know, we're going to... I have the diving attachment. We're definitely going to have to start doing those. No matter how terrified I am of deep water. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Let's get over here towards this little bit. And it's it's really, really close. I hope it's got a whole bunch of cool resources on... Oh, ships of the damned. Yeah, we don't like you. Stay over there. Nobody likes you. Stay away. No touchy and all that. All right? Gosh. And I definitely need to start making a bigger boat so uh, we can start taking on some of those flotillas. That's one of the things I want to do. Figure out how best to take on an entire flotilla. I don't think you can take them on all at once. I think you have to pull them out one at a time and then just kind of take them out that way. But if it works, it works. But I haven't figured out how to work it yet. But then again, we also don't have a big enough boat. So, yeah. All right, this looks... What is the big... Is that like a big elephant trunk over there? Oh, no, no, it just hadn't rendered in yet. Okay, Chips of the Dam must have been doing that. You know how sneaky they are. All right. Okay, now the trees are rendering in. I was worried there for a sec. I was like, hey, uh, is this going to be a dud of an island? But then all of a sudden the trees are just like starts popping in. So trees be popping. Everything's good. All right. Hopefully, uh, more trees... Oh, yep, yeah, more trees are popping. Going right into render. I like this bay. How deep is this bay? You know what? Let's go over inside the bay just so we can see just how deep this is. I have a feeling it's going to be pretty deep. If it's pretty deep, we, could, we might be able to use this island to build a big, big boat. And we, then we could probably use this little bay as a spot in between all the islands that we've got. And there's giraffes. Lower the sails a little bit. Okay, yeah, this bay is wicked deep. Alright. Oh, wrong way. Wrong button! Now, let's see. A little bit closer to shore here. Oh, there's ostriches! I like ostriches in this game. Alright, let's lower this down. And of course, it's hot. Full cloth armor, and it's hot. Alright, I'm gonna get the boat parked, and I'll see you guys in a sec. Alright, come on, Smackhead. Alright, and... You know... Parking the boat used to be really hard, but once I figured out how to back it up, yeah, <laughs> life-changing. Serious, that's exactly what it is. Life-changing. All right, let's see. Can we get this? Hey! Blainshear Island. Okay. We've got two of those. M5 and B5. Okay, so we've got a B5 one. Uh, let's take these out of here. And put the B5 one down here, just in case if we stumble upon it. Alright, let's go take a look at what... Oh, hey, there's another one. Alright, cool. Alright, let's go take a look and see what kind of resources they've got here. Um, what kind of stuff comes up from this? Uh, cobalt, limestone, and radiolarite. Okay, cool. That's stuff that we didn't have before, so that, which means that we can probably start making some of the other stuff. Um, and it is close enough to the other bases, so where we can just easily swap between the two. And nothing around here gonna come try to gank me. R wrong button. Oh, and this is hemp. Okay, we've already got hemp. We've got silk, hemp. Which means we probably need to go find another one. But there's rhinos and ostriches here. And sheep! Which means we might actually have to hang out here for a little bit. Oh, this is kind of a cool little inlet right here. I like this. This... Wow, we could build a, a cool little base that, like, is on stilts over the, uh, over the water. What level are you? You're level 11. Okay. All right, what level are you? Four. And you're two. Okay. 
Dude, what kind of wood is this? Scorpion right there. Strong wood and rushes. Okay. We've already got that stuff. Stop! Thank you. Alright, come on, dude. There you go. All right. See it up here in the mountain area. If there's any like gems or crystal or anything like that. Because if there is, more specifically crystal then we'll kind of be set between the different islands that we've got because we've got one that has gems on it we just need to find one that has a ready source of crystal okay here Can we get up there no all right ouch sorry speckhead All right, let's get looking around down here, seeing what all we can find. And I kind of enjoy this aspect of uh, Atlas. I mean, when you find a new... A new island, you can go all the way around it and see... Radio low, right? Okay. See what all... Will you stop eating? All right, uh, find what all kind of uh, stuff that you can harvest from it. It's kind of cool. And there's ostrich, pig, in the bush. And, of course, a ram. Oh, what is this? Oh, my. Oh, and there's even horses here. What is this? This cove is cool. Let's go take a look. All right, uh, how do we get down? That's Blue Parrot! Is this the right way? Yes! Nailed it! All right. Oh, hello, Alpha, alpha Crocodile! Nope, don't think so. I'm out of here! Nope, 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 no, 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 no. No, no Alpha Crocodile! All right? Can I shoot you? With my arrows? Get a bunch of free XP? No, don't be climbing up that. No, nobody likes it when you climb up that. How much XP am I getting? Probably not much. I've already leveled up quite a bit on alphas and stuff, so... Are you piecing out? Yeah? Yeah, go over that. There's an island over there. All right, I wanted to go take a look at this little inlet. And you're kind of blocking it for me. All right. Yeah, take off, dude. Am I lacking? Iden wood. Okay. <laughs> Come on, Smeghead. That was a close call, dude. All right, but this area right here is pretty neat. Why is that sheep running? Why are you running? Oh, okay. Come on. There you go. But yeah, I like this. Oh, there's crocodiles up there. Oh, I wonder if we could get up there. Oh, let's go see if we can work our way around the island. See if we can find a way up there. Okay, look at this. I, I like this island. I like this island a lot. I mean, this is great. There's so much cool stuff here. And, of course, scorpions eating all the local wildlife. I mean, if there's crystal here, I think we'll be set for a while. All we have to do is uh, quick sailing trips back and forth, which isn't really quick, but... We need to figure out a way to get up top of there. 
are you guys fighting? Fighting. Oh, it doesn't matter now. It's dead now, huh? <laughs> that was Cobra. Ooh, this is cool. Okay, and I have to admit, these blue uh, giraffes look wicked cool. I mean, I like our giraffe, but the blue ones are pretty cool. I, it's kind of amazing me that you can get them in this flavor. Still looking for crystal. I haven't found any crystal. I've already been up kind of as far as uh, Butt Spud would run up there. But I'm kind of looking down below, seeing if there's any crystal that spawns down here. I'm honestly not sure there is. Oh, what is this stuff? It's wild beans. Okay. Stop eating. Jeez, in Ark it's they're pooping, and in this game it's they're eating. And it stops them from moving all the time. Get over here. I think we're on the back side. Of that one, um, cove. Whole bunch of ostriches. There's a lot of wildlife on this island. It's a big island. Yeah, this is the opposite side of the cove. Think. Yeah, it is. I still haven't found any crystal. Hmm. All right. All right, and we're back. But I mean, I think we found a really good island here. Um, I think this would will totally serve our purpose for building up a massive ship. And then actually, I think even though the, I I wasn't able to find some resources like crystal and gem or anything like that. I think this island would definitely be able to serve as a main island because it's right next to the Freeport. It's just a hop, skip, and a jump away from the uh, um, oh the other island that has. What are you? What are you guys fighting? Okay, well it's got it's just a hop, skip, and a jump away from uh, the island that does have uh, gems and all sorts of stuff. Um, plus, also, um, it it's. Like I said, it's right next to a Freeport, and it's right next to C6 that has something. I think that might be a Power Stone Island. If that's a Power Stone Island, then we might be able to go farm a bunch of stuff on that, get Mythos, all sorts of stuff, and start really ramping up our game eventually. Oh, wow, that actually sounds kind of cool. Ooh. All right, so anyway, I think that's probably going to do it. I mean, I realize we just did some exploring, some sailing for the most part, um, going across a couple islands. But yeah, hey, I think we might have found a cool one. At least one that we could do a big base on. Um, one that we can uh, kind of settle up. And yeah, I see that rhino just kind of cresting the hill in the background right above my shoulder. That was kind of majestic, actually. All right, so hey, anyway, uh, if you liked the video, make sure you click that like button. I really appreciate that. If you're new around here, subscribe. And until next time, this is Flicker Foo, And take it easy, everybody. <sighs> wow, now we just have to get building. Yeah, just a bit of building. Mm-hmm. All right. Take it easy, everybody.